So we put a few videos out back on the 7th of February and I just wanted to do an update uh, of those, see how they've really come in. And this video we're going to be talking about the US dollar against the Swiss franc. So we had a, a buy trade come in on just where my cursor is there on the, uh, what was it, the 6th of February. So we did a part one of the video. We pushed it live on YouTube on the 7th, um, just as the trade was, uh, after the trade was confirmed. Um, and uh, well, look, here we are now. So I'm doing an update just to see how we got on as promised. And why are we going Long in this trade in the first place and what I want to cast your eyes on where my cursor is here you can see the big buy sniper just like we've had a few of them before but what's special about this one why am I talking about this one well it's a buy sniper against the longer term trend of the market we're going to take our eyes to the left hand side here you see the monthly where it's got that red arrow pointing down this means we're against the longer term trend of the market so the path of least resistance the longer term trend is down so we're going to be fighting against that trend now what you want to be doing is thinking about an additional reason to get you into a trade that is like that because we favor the shorts at this point and you've seen the market moving to lower highs lower lows but actually what we then started to see was a movement away from that we posted a higher high here pull back put in a higher low as the market then started to reverse back up again so whilst the pattern uh, longer term is in a downtrend we're starting to see that short term pattern that um, a reversal pattern higher highs higher lows starting to come in giving confidence to this as a buy trade and that's what we saw uh, so we saw the buy from the close of this bar at 97.45 and it was a nice buy against that longer term trend of the market what sort of targets are we looking at here you've got a few options of a trade like this and that kind of depends on where you're at as a trader do you want to be in get out quickly do you want to run that trade some of our clients as an example are running it according to the color of these indicators they're still in this trade and they're riding it now about 100 points in profit now 100 points on a market like the Dow or, or oil or maybe a sterling New Zealand isn't a huge amount of pips something like dollar Swiss it's a big amount of pips in relative terms that's a really really strong move people who want to get in and out quite quickly you can look at something the, the average true range of the market which is 46 points that's a steady amount of pips and actually hit that target um, what a few days ago beginning of the week the 14th uh, of uh, was that Friday uh, last week there so you know either way you're out of it for a nice profit or you're continuing to run it according to those lines so nice healthy profit on that trading opportunity and remember we called this live on YouTube and we'll continue to put trades out live on YouTube so have a look post in the comments let me know what you think of the trade were you in it why weren't you in it that sort of thing let me know with the comments and please subscribe like anything like that into that questions box and if you want to receive notifications when we put new trade uh, videos out just hit the alarm button or the alarm the bell uh, button there you know what to do and that'll give you a notification each time we release a new video onto our youtube channel all right guys have a great week's trading bye bye if you would like more information about trading the right way, TrendSignal is giving you the opportunity to see and hear about its services live at a free online seminar. Take a look at the TrendSignal website for the latest events and to book your free place.